Anthony Murdoch takes a closer look at how Rickards is preparing. Rickards High School band members are blowing their horns, beating their drums, and perfecting their moves, getting ready to take the field for the first time during Florida a and University's homecoming game. It means a lot because growing up, you always wanted to be a part of it. A chance of a lifetime that's bittersweet. They're stepping in for the famed Marching 100 band after hazing allegations rocked the campus. With the absence of the 100, it's great to see some people in Leon County, some, police, some people at Rickards High School actually still performing in Bragg Stadium. The last couple of weeks, band director Quincy Griffin has been preparing his band for its performance. But it's hard because you're not just dealing with an individual, you're dealing with an entire band. And so everyone has to pull their weight. But giving 100% can be easier said than done. This compares to any other sport that you can, it's, we do just as much work as football team, basketball team. I have kids that are students that quit band and join the football team because they think band is too hard. Though some band members may have given up, quitting was never an option for Imani Jones Harper, who sees this opportunity as a dream come true. Actually perform for them and actually go on a field means a lot to me. And it will mean a lot for Griffin and his band to entertain fans at the FAMU homecoming game. I'm Anthony Murdoch, WTXL, ABC 27, dedicated to you.